resonance imaging, commonly referred to as MRI, is a pain-free, non-invasive diagnostic imaging technology that utilizes a superconductive magnet, radio frequency pulses, and high-performance reconstruction computers to produce clear images of the anatomy. MRI scans offer greater detail when imaging soft tissue or non-bony anatomical structures when compared to X-ray, ultrasound, and CT scans. An MRI scanner produces high-definition images of the anatomy by placing the patient inside a large superconductive magnet. The magnetic field inside the MRI scanner is tuned to an almost perfectly homogeneous magnetic environment with less than 0.5 parts per million in non-uniformity. The magnetic field intensity inside the MRI scan room can reach levels up to 30,000 times stronger than the Earth's magnetic field. Once the patient is introduced to the high magnetic environment, the hydrogen molecules in the patient's body align themselves relative to the poles of the magnetic field. During the excitation phase of an MRI scan, radio frequency pulses and secondary magnetic fields interact with the molecules, causing them to flip upon their axis. The hydrogen molecules flip back into alignment between pulses. This is known as the relaxation phase. Receivers in the MRI scanner detect the movement of the hydrogen molecules as they flip upon their axis. The MRI scanner collects the scan data and sends it to a high-performance reconstruction computer for processing into 3D renderings. MRI proves to be a powerful diagnostic imaging tool to detect, diagnose, and monitor health conditions. Magnetic resonance imaging excels when imaging soft tissue, tendons, ligaments, and other non-bony structures. Unlike CT scans, MRI scanners do not emit ionizing radiation. This makes MRI scans the preferred imaging option for patients that require multiple scans over time while monitoring known conditions. Now let's take a look at some of the imaging applications of MRI scans. Optimized brain MRI techniques detect conditions such as infection, swelling, developmental abnormalities, stroke, and cancerous growth. Brain MRI scans with tailored RF techniques have the ability to produce high-definition images of anatomical microstructures to aid in the detection of vascular malformation. Diffusion-weighted imaging and diffusion tensor imaging allows for rapid diagnosis for stroke and trauma victims. Cardiac MRI scans are the gold standard with unsurpassed clarity when assessing myocardial viability. MRI allows doctors to evaluate the blood vessels, valves, and individual chambers of the heart. Advances in medical imaging technology allow doctors to get a live view of blood flow as it circulates through the heart with functional MRI scans. For more information regarding the clinical applications of MRI, please see our patient resources playlist or head over to mripetctsource.com where we feature a growing library of MRI resources. Links will be provided in the description. The MRI scan room contains a strong magnetic environment. Ferrous metal items should never enter the MRI scan room. Patients with pacemakers, neurostimulators, or metal implants should consult with imaging staff before entering the MRI scan room. And lastly, hearing protection is required for patients. MRI scanners produce images in part by emitting loud, high-frequency noises that can cause injury or damage to hearing after prolonged exposure. The sounds emitted during the MRI scan can reach levels as high as 120 decibels, which is as loud as sitting in the front row of a rock concert. Prior to beginning the MRI scan, hearing protection will be provided to the patient in the form of earplugs or headphones. Closed MRI scanners are the most common magnet type in clinical use. They feature a cylindrical design with full magnet enclosure that offers higher magnet strengths between 1 Tesla and 7 Tesla. The magnet bore width of a closed MRI is limited to 70 centimeters, while maximum patient weight is typically limited to 350 pounds with this design. Open MRI systems feature a double pillar design that maximizes patient access and visibility. The specialized imaging system offers magnet strengths up to 0.8 Tesla. This MRI scanner design is open on three to four sides and offers patients greater visibility when inside the magnet enclosure. 
MRI scan procedures average between 25 and 35 minutes to complete. Some exams may require a contrast agent to be administered during the MRI scan to enhance features within the anatomy. This process may add up to 15 minutes to the total scan time. Patients can expect to arrive 30 minutes before scheduled imaging procedure for check-in and screening processes. Total time spent at imaging facilities is typically between one and two hours. After patients have checked in, the MRI screening process begins. The MRI screening process ensures patients are safe to enter the MRI scan room and are free of metal items. Once the imaging patient is screened and cleared for an MRI scan, they are led into the MRI scan room. Patients are positioned on the scan table so that the anatomical region of interest sits as close to the magnet isocenter as possible. The MRI technologist may place pads, straps, or blankets around the patient during scan preparation to aid in patient comfort. Imaging patients are encouraged to remain as still as possible during the scan sequence to produce the best image quality possible. Once the patient scan preparations are complete, the table will slide into the MRI scanner until the anatomical region of interest is aligned with the magnet ISO center. The technologist will step into the MRI operator room once the patient is prepared to begin the MRI scan sequence. MRI operator rooms sit adjacent to the MRI scan room. RF shielded viewing windows ensure the MRI technologist can always keep visual line of sight with the patient and patients can always communicate with the technologist by way of a two-way speaker built into the MRI scanner. The MRI technologist will start the MRI scan remotely from the operator room. The scan sequence begins, and the magnet produces powerful primary and secondary magnetic currents. This is a non-invasive process and will not cause any harm or pain to the patient. High-frequency RF pulse sequences are emitted from the MRI scanner to interact with the molecules within the tissue. This interaction with the molecules in the patient's body is also a non-invasive process and will not cause any harm or pain to the patient. The RF pulses cause the molecules to flip upon their axis from a lower energy state to a higher energy state. Detectors in the MRI scanner sense the movement of the molecules and use the signal to create precise three-dimensional reconstructions of the anatomy. MRI scans provide safe, pain-free, and non-invasive diagnostic imaging exams. There are no known long-term side effects to an MRI scan. Patients may resume normal activities after the examination. It is advisable to drink plenty of water over the next 24 hours to help flush contrast agents that were administered during the MRI scan. The incidence rates of adverse reactions to contrast agents is less than 1%. Mild symptoms may include nausea, headache, or dizziness for a brief time after contrast has been administered. A link to the full article is available in the description. Thank you for watching.